so you have a slider bar but the problem is that it sucks it has does not even have a, any smoothing kind of effect that you expect so don't worry in this video i'm going to tell you how you can create a smooth bar like this with just one single of line of code promise me this will going to be just one line of code so first thing i will tell you that i have a slider in the game ui and this value is going to be zero but i can as decrease the value it's going to be set to the value that i set to it so let's set to back to the zero and back to the script we i have a if is start what is that going to be true when the game starts and a slider value that's going to be set to the score so when time every time i change the score is going to be changed startable but not smooth i want this changes smoothly as hell so for this i'm going to first comment this out we don't need this then we're going to use a math f lab free now math have bunch of the equations or functions that you never hear of it or you hate this in the real life but don't worry math have one also have one of the, my favorite function is is called smooth damp this function is literally awesome this is going to be smooth there's a name is going to smooth anything any value is going to smooth out it is i think somehow is better and more simpler than the lerp so i'm going to create a bracket then we need to give the current score in the case we have current score is slider score slider dot value then we need to the target that the value that going to reach with the value going to be his uh score then we're going to give a current velocity and honestly i will tell you i don't know what the hell is this if you try to give here zero is going to us our ear but the easiest way to fix this i'm going to up here and go anywhere here i'm going to create a float current velocity and it's going to be equal to zero just like this and then here if you type current velocity then you, then you also get going to get a error and you also need to include special three words that is going to be r e f and then we need to ask at last we need to give how the how we need to smooth remember if you give any value here is going to smooth according to this value remember the higher the value higher the smooth effect will be so i'm going to give it 100 and, go, and then multiply this by time sorry time dot delta time and then our value gets smooth now we need to store this smooth value so i'm going to create a a local variable called float current score and is going to equal to current score the in the score slider dot value we're going to set this slider value to the current score done now we have a smooth slider part that is completely smooth as hell now as the value increase going to smoothly increase the value to the hundred now let's start to play with something values i go to game changer and set value to 50 now it's back smoothly back to the 50 let's set to 25 we got back to 25 smoothly back to 100 and yes we got a smoothly fit oh sorry i increase the value to more than 100 so we get go back to zero and we set a zero so that's it we have the hell like a smooth bar so thanks for watching if you like this tip don't forget to subscribe and like the video